Hey, amazing creators. Today in this video, we are going to tell you more about frame rate and how to set the right frame rate in Filmora 14 to make your video look smoother and cinematic. Want to learn? Keep watching. Before we begin, if you haven't already installed Wondershare Filmora, please visit the official website and download the latest version. Then, install it on your computer. Also, remember to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so you never miss any of our upcoming videos. What is the frame rate? In video editing, frame rate is all about how many images flash by every second to give us that sense of motion. When you use a higher frame rate, everything looks super smooth and realistic. On the flip side, lower frame rates can give your video a more cinematic vibe, which can be pretty cool too. What is FPS? FPS stands for frames per second, and it indicates how many of these individual images are shown on the screen every second. For example, 24 FPS means 24 frames are displayed every second, while 60 FPS means 60 frames are displayed every second. Higher frame rates provide smoother, more fluid motion, making fast-moving scenes appear more realistic and allowing for more dramatic slow-motion effects. Lower frame rates can create a sense of motion blur or a slightly choppy effect, which is often preferred for cinematic looks and can be suitable for slower-paced content. Here is the comparison of the same footage rendered at a lower and higher frame rate. Higher frame rate clip has a smooth and fluid motion. Silent films were shot at 10 to 16 frames per second, which looks choppy. For movies and cinematic content, always use 23.9 or 24 frames per second. For live or sports broadcasts and general video recording, always go with 30 frames per second. If you're editing a high action sport or making slow motion effects in gaming videos, always use 60 frames per second. In cinema, frame rate is super important for creating various effects. For instance, if you combine a lower frame rate with a slow shutter speed, you can achieve a fun step printing effect. On the other hand, shooting at a higher frame rate gives you that beautiful, smooth, slow motion effect. It's all about the magic of frame rates and how they can transform the way we experience a scene. How to set the frame rate in Filmora. There are two ways to set your frame rate in Filmora. Setting the frame rate at the start of the editing, on the main editing board, Go to the file from the header menu and then select Project Settings. And then from the Frame Rate drop-down list, you can choose the frame rate according to your project. And now you can edit your video in the selected frame rate. Setting the frame rate at the Export Settings. Click on Export and then from the Preset, click on Advanced. And then from the Frame Rate drop-down list, select the frame rate and click on Apply. Now, when you export your video, it will export in the selected frame rate. When you choose a higher frame rate, the video file size will be bigger and the exporting time will be longer as well. The selection of the right FPS makes your video look smoother and cinematic. So next time, when you edit your video, choose the right frame rate. If you found this helpful, please give us a thumbs up and share it with your fellow creators and editors. And if you're into visual effects and tutorials, make sure to visit filmora.wondershare.com for more great content. Can't wait to see you in the next video.